your eyewitness weather forecast. Good evening, meteorologist Sam Masalski here with your check in on the weather. We're looking at a time lapse of downtown Utica throughout the day today. We started off with a couple of clouds out there, as well as temperatures in the 60s, and with mostly sunny skies as we got into the afternoon. We saw those temperatures getting into the 80s, so very, very nice there. Now, for current conditions, we're sitting at 85 degrees. We have a light breeze out of the west, southwest at 8 miles per hour, and those dew points in the lower 60s, so a little bit humid out there. Fortunately, it's going to get a little more uncomfortable as we head to tomorrow, though during the second half of the day on Wednesday, we have a cold front moving through, which is really going to knock those dew point temperatures down, which means it's going to be much more drier and pleasant air as we head into Thursday. Now, for our low temperatures tonight, we're going to be in the 60s across the board, very mild. 63 there in Old Ford, 64 in Utica, and 66 in Illion. So, not really a night where you want to open up the window before you head to bed. You want to crank up the AC and leave it cranked up for tomorrow because high temperatures in the 80s. 84 there in Old Forge, 88 in Utica, 87 in Illion, 86 in Cooperstown, and 88 in Oneonta. Very unseasonably warm, about 15 degrees above where we should be for this time of the year. Now, with mostly sunny skies tomorrow, we'll have a high index, about a six, which means you could burn in as little as 20 minutes. So make sure you're applying and reapplying that sunscreen if you'll be out for an extended period of time. Good rule of thumb here every two hours you should be reapplying that sunscreen. Now, for the future cast, moving it forward tonight, partly cloudy skies as we head to tomorrow. Then mostly sunny skies are expected throughout the day on Tuesday, though we'll have more clouds building in throughout the night into Wednesday. Severe thunderstorms moving through. Now, this will continue throughout the afternoon and evening hours as well. You can see here future cast picking up on those orange and red colors, denoting heavy rainfall. So these severe thunderstorms moving through, it's going to be about a two out of five on the severe weather risk. So a slight risk that what exactly does that mean? It means we could see those gusty winds, hail, downpours, as well as a small chance to see some tornadoes as well. So we'll constantly be updating you with the situation. Now to recap for tonight, we'll have partly cloudy skies, a light breeze out of the west, low temperatures in the mid 60s as we head into tomorrow, mostly sunny skies throughout the day, a breeze out of the west, 10 to 15 miles per hour and those high temperatures in the mid and upper 80s. Now for the seven day forecast as we head into tomorrow night, still those low temperatures in the 60s and we have severe weather as we head into Wednesday. Though after that cold front moves through, temperatures are going to knock right back down to the lower 70s by Thursday looking very nice, more or less where we should be for this time of the year. That will continue as we head into this weekend as well. Mostly sunny skies there, though we do have some scattered rain showers expected on Monday with a high temperature at 77 degrees. Jamie.